Morning guys, followed on from Lee's wonderful 810 video. We now move on to the Garmin 1000 video. Firstly, we're gonna to go to FTP, just to show you how to change it uh, to the value we sent you by email. So if you firstly uh, press the button at the bottom of the screen with the spanner and the crossed screwdriver, then use the down arrow to find training zones. Now press training zone. You'll notice two tabs come up, heart rate and power. Press the power zone. You'll notice several screens or several tabs on the screen. Press the top one for FTP. Then use the appropriate numbers to amend the number at the top, then press the tick button at the bottom. And you use the back arrow to go back to the main menu. We now go on to the SIM PTID number. For this one, on the Garmin, it can be done quite quickly. You can do it either way, but this is the quick way. If you scroll down from the top of the screen, like so, you bring a little subsection menu, and if you press on connect to sensors, like so, it brings up the add sensor list. If you click on the add sensor, and then select power, it starts searching for a Ant Plus power meter, which we haven't got. So to get rid of that, and to manually enter the SIM PTID number, if you press the plus symbol at the bottom right hand corner, and again, like the FTP, put the PT SIM number, or sorry, PTID SIM number, in there, then press the tick button. And that's your power simulated setup for this evening's session.